Hey guys, welcome to my YouTube channel. In this video, I will show you how to redirect to a thank you page in contact form 7. So without further ado, let's get started. Okay, so method number 1 consists of using a plugin. This is the best option for most users, but if you don't want to install a new plugin, please skip to the next section. First, let me show you the example we are working with. As you can see, we have here a basic form. And when I click the submit button, there is no redirection. To redirect to a specific page after form submission, we need first to install this plugin. Once it is active on your website, go to your contact form and a new tab will appear. Choose redirect from the actions list then click the blue button. This will create a new rule entry like this. Choose a name for this rule. Then select a page that you want to redirect to from the select page option. You can also redirect to a custom URL if that's what you want. When you are done, click the Save button. Now if I test the form again, this time I get redirected to my custom page. Alternatively, we can get the same result without using any plugins. However, this will require adding some PHP code to your theme files. Don't worry though, I will show you exactly what you need to do. First, you need to open your theme functions.php file. You can edit this file using multiple methods, but the easiest way is to use WordPress's built-in theme editor. In previous versions of WordPress, the theme file editor was under the Appearance menu. Now it has been moved to the Tools menu. Also, if you have a block theme, which means a theme with full site editing capability, you may not have the file already, so you will need to create a new one and upload it to your theme. If this warning appears on your screen, click I understand. Locate the functions.php file and scroll to the very bottom. Now copy this code and place it like this. I will leave a link to my article in the description. Don't forget to replace the example URL with your real page URL. Finally, click Update File for the changes to take effect. What this code does is to instruct the browser to go to a specific URL whenever a new form is submitted. As you can tell, this will work on all forms. We can also target a specific form with some minor modifications. I already covered this in my article so please make sure to check it out. A slightly different variation of this method is to only copy the JavaScript code and add it directly to the footer.php file. 
You can also insert this code inside the custom HTML widget and add it to your footer or any widget area that is visible on all your pages. This way you don't even need to edit any files. That's it for today guys. I really hope you found this video helpful. If you did, please like and subscribe for more content like this. Thanks for your time.